Welcome back farmers to our YouTube channel. In this video, I want to be brief and direct to the point. I want to give you an organic treat that cures all the types of coughs or the respiratory illnesses that affect our chickens. It doesn't matter if it's the chronic respiratory disease, also called mycoplasmosis. Uh, it doesn't matter if it's aspergillosis, also called the brooder pneumonia, or even uh, the gape worms that cause labored breathing in the chicken. Uh, the treat that I'm going to give you is effective in treating all these types of coughs or illnesses because it have a combination of organic treats that are able to eliminate the bacteria, the fungi and also the worms that can bring about these respiratory illnesses of chicken. In this video, I will also tell you how, the, how these treats work in the bodies of the chicken. I will also give you information on how to make this organic treat and the dosage that you are going to administer to your chicken so that you can be able to eliminate these respiratory illnesses from your chicken. Uh, therefore, make sure that you watch the whole video so that you can get the full information. If you haven't uh, subscribed to this channel, please make sure that you hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell notification so that you will be notified whenever we post a new video. Also, if you get value from this video, make sure that you hit the like button. The general signs and symptoms of any type of cough or respiratory illness uh, that affect uh, the chicken include the sneezing, coughing, watery eyes, also, there is the swearing of the eyes, there is the labored breathing which is characterized by gaping or the opening of the mouth to search for air. And this uh, labored breathing can also be a sign of gape worm which attacks the respiratory system of the chickens. And the treat that I'm going to give you is also able to eliminate this gape worm alongside uh, healing other respiratory illnesses. Other signs and symptoms include the pale combs and wattles, anorexia that is the lack of appetite and also lethargy that is the general body weakness of the chickens uh, which also causes depression. Uh, what could be the cause of these respiratory illnesses in chickens? There are three major categories of the causes that leads to these respiratory illnesses in chickens and number one is the microorganisms for example the bacteria the fungi and also the parasites like the gape worms number two is about um the poor routine management uh, poor routine management include poor ventilations you know lack of proper hygiene that is not washing you know the drinkers and the feeders uh, feeding the chickens expired feeds that are poorly stored or lack of proper litter management uh, which causes the accumulation of ammonia and ammonia now affects the respiratory tract of the chicken which leads to uh, exposure to these illnesses for example the chronic respiratory uh, disease the third category of what causes this uh, respiratory illness is the combination of these two that is the combination of the microorganisms and the root and the poor routine management for example if there is poor hygiene uh, this will lead to accumulation of the pathogens or the microorganisms that are capable of causing the disease and based on these sources that is why a prevention remains the best way to treat diseases but how are we going now to treat these illnesses organically before you even sort out what treatment to take always isolate sick birds from the healthy ones so that you can be able to prevent the transmission of the infection and so that you can be able to effectively treat this sick bird and also you can be able to monitor them properly because you know when they intermingle with the others you cannot be able to monitor them and also this helps in faster recovery because you know they are able to feed separately but if you put this, these sick birds with the others they will transmit the disease and they will not be able to compete with the others for feed so they are going to be suppressed leading to more deterioration and now let's get into the organic treats and how do these organic treats work or what is their mode of action when they get into the system of the chicken the treats i'm about to give you have antibacterial antifungal and antiparasitic properties which help to kill bacteria fungi and parasites which cause respiratory illnesses in the chickens 
The first treat that I'm going to talk about is a combination of turmeric and pepper. Pepper has the antiparasitic properties that is it is able to clear the worms. Therefore, it is very effective against the gap worms. And the turmeric has antibacterial and antifungal properties. And this will help to eliminate diseases like the chronic respiratory disease and also aspergillosis or the brood and pneumonia. Uh, when it comes to pre preparation, you are going to wash this turmeric and pepper properly. Then you are going to put them into the blender. Make sure that you use equal amounts. That is, if you are using 250 grams of turmeric, use two, also 250 grams of pepper. Then you are going to put them in the blender. You are going to add some water and you blend them together. Or the blended combination that you are going to get is now the one that is going to be used to be added into the drinking water of the chickens. The amount that you are going to add or the dosage that you are going to use is one teaspoonful per three liters of the chicken drinking water. And you are going to offer this two times a week. But for the severely affected birds, you are supposed to give them this decoction or this mixture by mouth. Make sure that you give each chicken 5 ml of this blended juice and this helps to increase the effectiveness uh, so that you can be able to eliminate these infections. The second treat is garlic and garlic, we have been talking a lot about garlic and it has this antimicrobial and anti antifungal and also antioxidant uh, properties which helps in the recovery from these uh, respiratory diseases. Uh, when it comes to preparation of garlic, you're just going to remove the cover and uh, you take the cloves, you put them in a mortar and pestle or any other way that you can be able to crush them properly. After crushing them, that, then now you're going to uh, scoop them with the teaspoonful and you put them into the chicken water and that's how you're going to start so that now the garlic can be able to blend properly with the water so that now you can be able to treat these respiratory illnesses the third treat is the coconut oil the coconut oil has been found to have antibacterial and antifungal properties that are very effective when it comes to treating the respiratory diseases in chickens uh, for the severely affected chicken make sure that you give them by mouth uh, so that you can be able to bring down these you know infections but uh, for the other chickens you can add the coconut oil in the drinking water or in the uh, drinking water make sure that you hit uh, the video on your screen right now so that you can be able to know the seven best growth promoters for the broiler chickens